everyone, my name's Cold Phazon, and welcome back to Super Mario Galaxy 2! In the last episode, we arrived! No, wait, we didn't arrive. We arrived like two episodes ago. We did the one galaxy that looked like the Dreadnought Galaxy. I forgot the name. Uh, I should have taken a look earlier. Space Storm! <laughs> there we go. And then after that, we went to this another shitty gravity level, Upside Down Dizzy Galaxy, and then we went to an awesome level, which is the Boom Moon Galaxy. Today, we're gonna be exploring three more galaxies, and we're gonna start with this Pyramid Head. I was gonna say Pyramid Head. Oh my god, okay, Dead by Daylight, stop. A uh, Pyramid looking galaxy. Can you imagine a whole galaxy looking like a pyramid? What? Anyways, the Slip Sand Galaxy. Let's get started. Ooh, oh my god, I'm so excited. No, I'm not. <laughs> Anyways, we have the Squizzards Sandy Sinkhole. Let me change my page so I can cheat. <laughs> Anyway, so I said Pyramid Head subconsciously because in Dead by Daylight, um, if you don't know this, uh, the Silent Hill series, um, which is a horror series, um, Konami owns it now, and they don't do shit with it anymore! Anyways, um, hopefully in the future they will someday, please. <laughs> um, that's, it's a series I have to get into someday, um, but it's a horror. Anyways, there's a killer in there. Um, it, it's like a, a weird thing. Anyways, his name's Pyramid Head. And he's in the Silent Hill series. And, yeah, he's in Dead by Daylight, and he's fucking annoying. Anyways, <laughs> let's go. Travel to the sand. I kind of like the music here. You know, I'm going to be honest, I forgot where the Comet Metal is in this level. But I think I'll eventually see it. See it. See it. Wait, wait. So we have this, like, really, it reminds me of a worm now. Cause you know worms have like this, like that one part on their body, and then it's like it's long. <laughs> I don't know. I don't. Ah oh, no! Wait! Oh god! It hurt. I'm not making any sense right now. I don't think it's right here though. I hope I didn't miss it. I kind of forgot where it was. <clears throat> Anyways. Um, when it comes to desert levels in, uh, the, um, in, uh, video games, I don't mind them too much, because I really like shifting sand lands from- Oh my gosh, stop it! Oh my god, why do you gotta be so dumb? A freaking cursor! <clears throat> I don't mind shifting sand lands, and I enjoyed the other sand level in the first galaxy game. Ugh, you little whore! Oh, wait. Can you get out of here? There it is. Right here. Yay! Oh gosh, that almost got me. <gasps> we have the fire flower. Anyways, I don't really mind the desert levels too much. Odyssey had a desert level. I didn't mind that one too much. Though I would say it's not my favorite level. Or favorite world. In the, uh, in the Odyssey game. Okay, don't get crushed! Oh god, you lean back, lean back right now. Go, 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 go. Whoa! Yes! Oh! Anyways, the green, um, pokies are called... Wait, what? what? Oh, gosh, stop it. Why do I not remember any of these? Oh, they're called... Oh, wait, I'm stupid. They are pokies. I thought there was, like, a different name to them. Those are just pokey heads. Stop! Oh, God. Stop struggling. Stop struggling on the stuff you're not gonna struggle... Like, you shouldn't have to struggle with. Though I do love this part right here. This big ol' ass. It's like the pyramid, but you see, like, these giant-ass things in the background. Like, what is that? Nintendo sometimes makes the background look really cool. Because it's kind of like, I want to go there. Like, all the way to the top of those, like, towers. They're, like, really gigantic. Kind of reminds me of Zelda in some way. But anyways, we have these rolling things. Don't get crushed. Oh, gosh. Stop. It's a little sensitive. What the heck are these things called? Rongos? Oh, shoot! Wait. Okay, now we gotta go in the middle because it's gonna get thinner. Thinner. Don't freak out. Don't freak out. This is perfect. Ooh. Okay. Whew. That was scary. What is this called? Oh, they're called ROMs. ROMs. Oh, and then we had the cluck booms. I wasn't paying attention, I'm sorry. 
Oh, well. Anyway, so we made it to the checkpoint! Yay! And now... Oh, no! I didn't see that! It tricked me! I actually wanted to get a life shroom. Oh, but that guy was all the way over there in the corner! We have this ugly, creepy thing called Squizzard. And we're gonna have to kill it. And we're gonna have to kill it. Wait. When its mouth opens, you do that! Ugh. Come on, dude! He like throws stuff at you at the same time you're trying to hit. And then eventually you go ahead and throw fireballs in his mouth, so. Fireballs, yum! His mouth is open! Oh god, okay. Kinda gives you a small window when he opens up his mouth, so... You gotta try to do that as quickly as you can. And he don't like me. He's getting angry. He got, he got sand cannons coming out of the sand. But, uh, as with the fire flower power, it's only for a limited time. I know... Oh gosh. Wait, go, go! Hit him, hit him! Got it! Okay, there we go. Not bad at all. When he's throwing those things at you, you can break them with uh, the Fire Flower ability. But we didn't really have to do that. Pretty easy, yeah! Wait, I miss. Oh my gosh. I'm lame. Anyways, today is... I don't know. I want to say Friday, but I'm not sure. Because I'm not 100% sure. Because <laughs> I'm going to be busy probably for the next two weeks. So I wanted to get, to get at least four videos out. So I might put... Uh, I'm putting the other one out Monday. And then this one might be Friday. But I'm not 100% sure. But anyways, so... I don't know if you guys are into spicy stuff. But... I love spicy stuff. Actually, let me do this Hungry Luma here. I finally got the 1500. <laughs> it only took playing the same level like five, six times. I like spicy stuff. And my friend, uh, I think it was like two days ago I got in the mail, he gave me... He ordered me hot sauce. Which is kind of a weird birthday present, but I love spicy food. And I guess it's on this... It's called the Heatonist. And it's like, they sell hot sauce. It's a website and they sell just nothing but hot sauce. And he sent me the hottest one there. Which, the heat rating on that is an 11 out of 10. And I haven't had spicy stuff in a good while. So whenever I don't have really spicy stuff for a while, I like struggle with super, super spicy stuff. And then about a couple of days later, I get used to it. And so when I tried this hot sauce... Oh! Oh my gosh, I was like crying and like I had to blow my nose out and shit. I was like, oh my god. It was like really painful. I was like, oh my gosh, this is so hot. New galaxy was born. <laughs> and then finally on the third day, I got used to the heat. So I wasn't like struggling anymore. I was still spicy, but like I wasn't struggling. And I was actually appreciating the flavor, but... That was an early birthday gift from my best buddy, Jesse. I don't know if he's watching these videos. I love you. Uh, but yeah, the hot sauce was really freaking hot. Um, but uh, it was really good. And he was telling me about a ghost pepper blueberry flavor. I know it kind of sounds gross a bit, but apparently the reviews are really, really good. So I ordered that. And then I ordered a really hot garlic flavor. And I absolutely love garlic. So I'm getting those in the mail eventually. Maybe like Wednesday or Thursday. So... I'm excited. I'm like, yeah, I'm ready to burn my mouth. Anyways, the Hungry Luma has created the Fleet Glide Galaxy. Glide in the in the name of this thing. So, ha. Huh, it's going to be fun, I guess. And we have the Fluzzards Wild Battlefield Glide. Oh, well. There we go. You know how I feel about Fluzzard. Not the most favorite galaxy but whatever i gotta do it it must be done but the good thing is is these 
types of levels don't have a comet. So, yeah. Fluzzard, Fluzzard! He says you're okay and that you can glide with him. Will you glide with Fluzzard? Yeah, let's glide. You can glide through the big sun circle at the end. You win! You win! But it's not easy, not easy. Oh, I know it's not. If I smack the wall, I'm dead. So I'm gonna try my best to do this. All right, here we go. Dodge the big blob of bitches. Can I get the light room? Yes. Gotta be careful. I gotta glide. I gotta glide. I should spin, 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 spin this way. Don't hit the damn wall, please. Oh, oh, shit. No, wait. I'm supposed to keep spinning. Oh, God. Don't no, hit the wall. I'm turning left, you stupid fucking bird. What is this? You suck. <laughs> Through the gate. Oh, my fucking God. <laughs> you suck. Jeez, man. I was hitting everything. Gosh. Wait, please let me make this. Please let me. I have time. I have time. We. Oh gosh, I almost hit that. Oh god, the bullet bills. Ah! My god. Okay. We're almost there, guys. The uh the the comet medals at the end, so I gotta swoop in and grab it. As you can see, I missed the live stream a second time. Oh shit! Don't hit the pole. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Wait, what? It blew- Oh my god, I forgot he had to hit all the rings! <laughs> yeah, hit the damn ring. God. What the fuck? The stupid fucking bat, really? Oh. <laughs> god! Oh my god, if I miss this. Oh my gosh, I thought the stupid rumbling messed me up. Oh, I got it. <laughs> my gosh, I can't believe I hit that stupid bat earlier. <laughs> you flew, you flew! <laughs> you kind of struggled there, an idiot. Even Flessard looks happy, even though he got whacked a bunch of times. Take the star. Thanks. They're kind of cute, but like, I don't know. I'm not really into birds. My mother likes birds. When I go to the pet store, though, to like pet the certain birds, they kind of just nibble on your finger, which I don't really mind. They don't really hard bite you. Some of them are kind of cute. Like, they'll climb on your finger. Like, eh. Like, you know, I want a head bob with ya. Because I remember I had um, a bird do that. They were a really cute bird. But yeah. I like going to the pet store to see the cute dogs and then see some cats if they're there. Usually the cats are gone because people take them really quick. I don't know. But, but I also see the ferrets. Because ferrets are freaking cute and I love ferrets. <laughs> Maybe I'll get a ferret one day. <laughs> they're so adorable. Anyways. Oh, next. Last star we're gonna get. We're gonna be going to the Shiverburn Galaxy. Woo! Another ice level type galaxy. So I'm really excited for this one. This one is Prince Picante's Pepper Day Moon. With the hot sauce that my friend got me. Oh, wait, by the way, wait, I don't think I told you the name of the hot sauce. It was called, I think it's called The Last Dab. It's called The Last Dab. I was telling somebody about this in a Twitch chat and they're like, it tastes like acid. I guess they had that hot sauce before. I'm like, it's really hot, but like, you can still taste the flavor in it. And the blueberry one I ordered is a 6 out of 10 heat, apparently. And then the garlic one. It's like a garlic reaper. That one's an 8 out of 10. So those probably aren't going to be as hot compared to the one my friend got me. Jesser on the dresser. <laughs> Anyways. Oh, I see a life stream there. I'm going to go ahead and grab the cloud ability. It's a lot easier maneuvering. Do this, dude. No, no, no. A lot easier maneuvering through the... Well, I say that now, and I'm back on this platform. So you're on the level. Because there's a cool part coming up, and I like it. Oh, God, do it for you, burn your butt. Get over here. Hit this button. And... Look at that. Everything is turned to ice. 
I kind of struggled there with my voice for a second. Uh, but yeah, everything is ice, which is really cool. You can skate on it. It's really? Oh, God. Have I been over there? Oh, wait, those are the, like, never mind. Platforms can't be moved anymore. <laughs> I was like, have I been over there? Which is a really cool effect. I really how, like how they did that. It went from just pure lava to just pure ice. <gasps> Ooh, I'm killing you. I'm going for you. Never mind. You're going to be one with the lava eventually. Well, I'm going for killing you. No. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Okay, we're good. We're good. Stop it. Stop. Stop that right now. Can I? I was going to try to log jump over there. Oh, you can. Oh, no. I fucked up. Oh, gosh. Please. Please. Gosh. No. Just kidding. I got killed by an octo. Shit. <laughs> oh, never mind. <laughs> I was trying to hit kill him at the same time. I need to stop before I actually, like, mess myself up. Oh, gosh. Okay, just go to the next area. Sheesh. Stop messing up. <laughs> Pressing around. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> okay. We're over here. Get out of my way. Go hit that. All right, there we go, there we go, there we go. <laughs> okay. I was like, where is the thing again? I forgot, no! I'm gonna kill you, I'm gonna kill you. No, unless you kill me first! Oh. Dude, I'm struggling. Shut up! Nah, forget it. I'm just gonna run. I don't remember if there's a live stream over here. But I wanted to grab the freaking common medal, so I didn't miss it, you know? I'll just kill these guys. I say that so casually. Okay. I really like this effect, too, because it's all ice, and then the little meteors come in and then turn these areas into little pools of lava. Oh my gosh, Mario, do not do that. You're really... Oh, there's a live stream. Okay, I was like, I don't remember there's a live stream here. Ugh. I don't want to be in the skating animation right now. I'm a little scared. Okay. Whew. We're almost at spicy picante. But before that, we got these nasty little, like, octo turds. When I said octo shit before I cut it, um... Uh, I wanted to say octo rock, but that's from Zelda. Ooh, nice. Two for two. Ha <laughs> ha. Sorry, I just wanted to, like, look at something. What are those things called? Oh, they're just called octopuses. I thought that said octopus for a second. I'm like, what are these, like, tall octo turds look like? Like, what are the names? Oh, never mind. We're almost there. And then it's kind of cool that they do it in reverse. So instead of the lava pouring into the ice, it's the ice pouring into the lava. Oh, I just, I really like lava levels. They're always super fun. Ice levels, I think a lot of people are kind of like, oh, I don't know, because a lot of people hate ice physics. But, yeah. All right, I already got a life stream. I don't know how you wouldn't get that unless you were scared you are going to fall off, I guess, for the other one. But we're at the boss now, and it is Prince Picante! But, yeah, if you want to get out of the ice, you just do your, um, Oh, there we go. He spits out a coconut eventually. I'm pretty sure that's a coconut. Get out of your ice animation. You kind of just shake your Wii remote in the air. Okay, so I see him, but like... Oh, it's over there, but that's so far away. What the hell, man? But yeah, I'm pretty sure those are coconuts. I don't know if you guys know, but like when coconuts grow on trees, they have an outer green layer. And then you like peel it like you open it. And then it's the brown nut that, like, everybody's familiar with. Oh my gosh, Cursor! I think I'm just too close to my, uh, sensor bar. I'm trying to not be so close, but, like, I gotta be close because my mic is <laughs> kind of close. I already got three hits on her. Damn, get wrecked, nerd. GG easy. Later. Oh, we did it. Oh, oh. Look 
at us, guys. Man. 51 stars. Kind of halfway there. Not really. A letter addressed to the baby bitch. A letter to the baby little has arrived. There are many kind-hearted people out there who are watching over you. I hope the attached item is helpful. May the star shine upon you. Why don't you pick up your last Luma? How about that? Like, you, how many letters have you sent over here? Like, you know where we are. Like, what? Yeah, no return address. Because she doesn't want the Luma. She's giving it to me. It's cute as hell. Anyways, I think I'm going to end for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching, obviously. Next time on Super Mario Galaxy 2, I think we're going to probably do another three more stars. And then possibly after that, maybe get the fourth star, which would be Bowser Jr. here. So yeah, we're going to go about three, four stars. Let's see how fast I get the stars. But yeah, thank you all for watching. And I'll see you guys later.